<clears throat> Alright, so today I'm wearing, <coughs> I have tonsillitis, tonsillitis, sorry, um, this shirt from Betty and Veronica, it has Betty on one side and then Veronica on the other side, I have these jeans that my sister gave me that were way too big, so I like, I don't have my sewing machine, so like, oops, can't really see it, but like I had to sew it, and it looks kind of messy, but like, no one should be staring at my butt like that. At least I hope no one's staring at my butt like that. And then, since my outfit for today is 1950s style um, inspired, um, I wore my Converse today. I was thinking of wearing my heels, but I have to take the bus and walk a little bit, and I'm just not in the mood. Um, but in the 50s, their main go-to sneakers whenever they had to do sports stuff. Were these? Um, and then I chose my black wig today because Veronica is my favorite out of Betty and Veronica. For Archie Comics characters, it goes um, Jug, no, Sabrina, Jughead, and then Veronica. And then I have these earrings that I got in South Korea two years ago, this time last year, time goes by very fast um and then I have a Chanel ribbon in my hair um my glasses are from Amazon and then the makeup I'm wearing um the eyeshadow was all ColourPop their Disney uh, princess palette and then the eyeliner is Z -Z -Z. heroin kiss me the, the the kiss me Japanese brand and then, um, the mascara is Chanel, and then the lipstick is from the Bell's Color from the ColourPop Disney Collection, and then the lip gloss is Chanel, um, 104, I think. And then, oh, that's it. Um, well, I'm gonna go run to the bus, um. The bus comes in, I think, about 15 minutes, but I always like to stand out there at least, like, 10 minutes before in case the bus, like, miraculously in America, of all places, comes early. But today, if you didn't get it from the title, we're gonna go... Oh, I'm not in the thing. We're gonna go to, um, a place in the city that I go to school in that has, um, a soda fountain thingy. And they took an old um, counter from the 1950s and um, refurbished it, and now they sell 1950s style soda. So, how oh, my voice? We're gonna go do that. I sound like old man Jenkins. <laughs> A bus well there's two buses that were for that's for our um marching band because they're going on some sort of trip um i'm not really into our marching band because i only <laughs> i only really like black marching bands because like they always dance and they do flips and splits and crap um so i've been kind of spoiled <laughs> um so seeing like a regular Marching bands just isn't exciting for me, um, but um, their buses for their trip were in the way of like the bus depot and our regular school buses and then the city buses go through that bus depot so it's a whole mess and then I had to like run across the street to get onto the bus and then the bus driver went ahead anyway and went into the bus depot and then he kind of just honked the horn for like 15 minutes to get them out of the way because honestly he was in the right like they could have just parked in that parking lot but then they didn't um oh god bees oh god um i mean like they, they shouldn't have parked in the middle of the freaking bus depot um because the school buses like they were confused too and then they ended up, they probably um, phoned in and told them that, like, don't even bother going to Riverview. But, like, they made no announcements to the students. 
to not go into, to not bother to try, hold on. Okay, sorry. I thought that I had passed it, maybe. Um, because I just have to walk straight and then end up in there. Um, but no, yeah, that was interesting. Um, now I'm walking, I see it from here, um, to, uh, they converted the old, um, mill house, mill house, the old factories within here, this city here, um, they converted it into, like, apartments and all sorts of other nonsense, and right now I'm going to the place that has the soda fountain crap in it and a bunch of other stuff that's real cool, real neat. I haven't been here, I think, in a couple of years because um, our school does events here, but, like, I'm typically at work, so even if it's something that interests me, I can't go because I kind of need money more so than the school event. Um, so it's been a while. Uh, is this the entrance? I don't really remember. Okay, hold on. All right, so I'm an idiot. Um, <laughs> I walked into the residence place that they have and the place that I'm actually going to is right across the street and says it in big old letters. 15,000 times. So, how I've survived this long, I don't know. Um, it will be 23 years. Um, probably mostly due to my mom. Um, how I went to a foreign country by myself, I don't know. Um, and survived, I don't know.
original release, I guess. You, yeah, an original release of Led Zeppelin Deuce. Um, it was twenty dollars. I'm trying not to think about it. I'm gonna keep it in this little wrap thing, but I'm gonna open it just to show you people. Um, so this was what this was because I saw it when I peeked in. I thought it was just like a little paper advertisement. I mean, it is kind of an advertisement for all the other crap. And there. I think this is all, at yeah, it's all Atlantic. Can y'all? Hold on. So you got the Rolling Stones. Another Red Zeppelin now, which I feel like shouldn't be a surprise. Um, and another. I'm just going to be under the general assumption that this is just advertisement for if you bought this, come get this. Um, I'm supposed to be majoring in history, am I not? And then, boop, that's what the record looks like. Now, I don't own a record player, <laughs> so, and I won't be owning one anytime soon because I don't actually have my own room. I have my own room when I'm at school, but... When I'm at home, home, I share a room with my mom. But, um, this is the whole thing. It has all their names and little thing things. And then here's the, 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 the track list. Um, This one is my favorite one that I listen to very often. And that's the back. But, um, hold on. The, so, I had ordered a strawberry soda with, a strawberry soda that was a float, so it had vanilla ice cream in it. And then I ordered a banana split. I couldn't finish a banana split. Um, I mean, I like kind of finished it, but then kind of didn't because I left a little bit of banana left. And then a bunch of the ice cream kind of melted midway through me eating it. So, like, I kind of finished it. Um, and it was really good. 10 out of 10. It was a nice experience. I'm really squeamish. So, like, it wasn't as clean as I would wish it to be um because whenever I'm out in public and I see like dirt encrusted into like the sides of like surfaces and stuff which is normal urine public things I get kind of grossed out and then like because 1950s bar things had like the stool was kind of up high so then your feet rested on this little rest on the bottom um that was obviously covered in like dirt and stuff that was like ingrained in its being but like people peep the freak bear so that's kind of what happens so don't listen to me um <laughs> for the average person it's fine but for me and how squeamish i am i'm like mm. I don't know. But, um... Oh, let me say that again because you saw something you wasn't supposed to say. 
Um, so like, even though since I'm squeamish, like the cleaning level was a little not up to par with me, but like it was just normal, like you're in public and so there's going to be like dirt encrusted into the corners of surfaces type of nonsense. Because I'm squeamish, um, I was like, mm. um, but for people who aren't insane, um, it's perfectly fine. Um, I could never be a food critic. It was really good. It was like, uh, for my Hispanics, um, you know, like the red soda, like the red soda, like how you have like, y'all know what I mean. It was, it tasted like that, but with ice cream in it for the drink. And then the banana split it tasted like a banana split. Um, and the banana wasn't mushy, so that was good. And uh, I forgot banana split usually has chocolate ice cream. I'm not really a fan of chocolate, like anything. Um, unless it's like Borea Rocher or like the Hershey's Almond Bars. Um, but like, I mean, I still dealt with it. It was still good. But, um, that's it for today. Is my nose still swollen? I have allergies now, apparently. And so, like, I have to... I have to take a nasal spray to... Because the inside of my nostrils were, um, swollen, inflamed. I don't know. I had to go to the doctor, and they were like, take a nasal spray for a month, and if it doesn't go away, you gotta go to a specialist. So hopefully, I think it's going away. But, like... Probably have to go to that special any specialist anyway because I have tonsillitis and it won't go away. So that's my life. And now I'm really tired. I'm gonna take off this makeup and my pants. I'm gonna lay down and probably fall asleep. But that was my day. Um. <laughs> I knew I couldn't talk to you guys while I was in there because it was awkward. Um, and I'm not used to vlog vlogging. So, especially in public, that's, mm. um, but, um, that's it. If you want to see more, you see all my lip gloss is off and I forgot to wear my lip gloss. Um, but I'm in my room now. I'm going to take all this off anyway, so it doesn't matter. What am I saying anymore? So if you... Uh, subscribe and stuff. I don't know. I'm so sleepy. Oh my god. <laughs>
the, the, the history behind it and the person that owned it. Sometimes I wish that was an actual thing. So you could learn about where things come from and what they've been through. But I feel like at the same time, that would get really annoying and disturbing after a while. If that was like a power that you had, especially like in the beginning, because you wouldn't have any control over it. Like, think of like all of the tragic things that have happened in America. Like, you'd just be seeing, seeing some death of a Native American like 15,000 times. Or like, the enslavement of some black person 15,000 times. Like, that's a lot. Like, you'll touch a building and then all of a sudden you see enslaved African people's building it. That's a lot. Never mind. It's not as cool as I thought it was going to be. Okay, bye.